Hi everyone, my name is Victoria and this is Look and Learn. I'm at the Mississippi Museum of Art where earlier today I went by the gift shop just because it's fun to look sometimes. And this book caught my eye. It's called Oh Picasso. And we've got it in the shop because we have a painting by Pablo Picasso here at the museum. It's called the Chinese Chest of Drawers, and it's part of a special exhibition called Van Gogh, Monet, Degas, and Their Times. And even though the art by Picasso at the museum is a painting, and this is a book about sculpture, I thought it'd be neat to show the different kinds of art that Pablo Picasso made. You know, artists don't have to stick to one kind of art. And art can be made out of all sorts of things, not just special supplies. You can make art out of whatever you might find around the house, like cups or old parts to a bike, even boxes. After the book, I'll give you some tips on how to make some art out of things you might have already at your house. But first, let's get to the book. Oh, yes, very nice orange. Oh, Picasso by Mille Nipold and Jean-Yves Verdu. What is this? I am water, falling from on high. I am a tin moon, hooked to the night sky. Oh, I am a guitar. And this? What is this? I am a lollipop, dreaming. I am a snail, hiding inside a rose. Oh, I am a little girl, jumping rope. What is this? I am a robot, playing catch. I am an elephant, stuck in the mud. Oh, I am a baby baboon in my mommy's arms. What is this? I am a stairway. Where do I lead? I am a paper mask waiting to be worn. Oh, I am another guitar. And what is this? I am a spider, doing a handstand. I am a dolphin, leaping through the air. Oh, I am a bull. Can your bike do this? Oh, thank you, Mr. Picasso. And interesting, other pictures of the art. And that great orange again. The end.
I would use the word fun to describe those pieces by Pablo Picasso. It's like he wasn't trying to make anything look like real life. If anything, he was just trying to make people smile or even laugh a little bit. And for this sculpture project, let's make that the goal. Why not? Here are some ideas on how to make art like Pablo Picasso with objects you might find at your house. Maybe you have boxes. Maybe you have cups. Maybe you'd like to make art out of sticks you find outside. All those work. To connect my pieces of sculpture together, I'm using tape. Maybe you'd like to use glue, or you'd like to connect your pieces by wrapping string or wire around them. You can get creative with the connecting. To decorate, I have a black permanent marker and some aluminum foil. You can use different colors of markers. You can also use pencils or paint. Acrylic craft paint or house paint works great. To begin, start cutting up your boxes, maybe tearing them apart and arranging them in ways that you find interesting. You might start off with an idea like, I'm going to create a sculpture version of my pet, and that's fine. Or you can just see what emerges. The great thing about working with cardboard boxes is it doesn't have to be perfect. And if you mess up, you can just use another box or whatever other objects you might find. And eventually, I created a little puppy dog with an aluminum foil collar. He definitely makes me smile. I could leave him the way he is, or I've got some really great yellow house paint at home, and I could paint him so he doesn't even really look like cardboard anymore. And I could keep drawing and painting, adding more things, like more dots. Either way, I hope that you can create something that makes you smile, maybe even makes you laugh, and I hope you enjoyed the book. See ya!